What's up guys, in this video I'll be showing you as how to download Android L on your Moto G variant. Now this works for a single sim and a dual sim variant also uh, and you can see I have currently the Moto G uh, in my hand and I'll be also leaving the links in the description for the files that you need to download and place it on in your device and also I'll be leaving uh, I'll be also giving you the detailed description as what's working and what's not so if you want to install it please have a look at the description and then go along with your installation now you should have your latest recovery as you can see I have the latest TWRP recovery installed onto my device and also your device should be rooted and your bootloader should be unlocked now the first thing that you need to do is you have to back up your device as it's mandatory and if something goes wrong then you can just uh, uh, restore your device in a very uh, convenient manner so as you can see I am backing up my device and I'll be getting back to you when this has been done so as you can see my device has been backed up now I'll be going back uh, into the uh, recovery mode now what you need to do is you have to select the option as wipe and uh, select the option advanced wipe select Dalby cache and uh, cache just uh, swipe to wipe go back again and swipe to factory reset after this has been done you have to go into the install option and uh, scroll down and you'll be finding the files in the i'll be just i'll be providing in the description as you can see the g apps file and the android l for filecom just select the android l as i'll be just zooming in a little bit more and select the option as experience 9 swipe to confirm flash so as you can see it's not successful again go back and uh, flash the gapps so this has been uh, done you have installed your rom and also your gapps now just select the option as the reboot system and you'll be taking into your reboot option here so this is the uh, boot logo that you'll be getting and uh, please wait for at least five to six minutes as it might take you long for for the first boot that you'll be going through onto your device So you can see the booting up has been done and it took me around 5 minutes for the boot up process to go through. So let's, I'll be getting back to you when I just uh, set up my device. So as you can see my device has been set up and you can see Android L running on Moto G and it's really smooth and also I'll be showing you the version that currently I'm running right now and uh, you can see I'll just zooming in a little bit more. You can see Android version 5.0 and the kernel version, the build number and uh, you can see each and everything is available. But the main thing here is that uh, for a dual sim variant, you won't be getting the signals. Uh, so if you are a single sim, single sim variant, you will be getting the signals uh, and your device will be perfect. If you, are, if you have a dual sim variant, you won't be getting the signals as you can see. So let's see if the Wi-Fi works or not. Just going into the brightness option and uh, increasing the brightness here and uh, let's see if the wi-fi works or not let's go into the browser and as you can see the wi-fi works excellently and uh, let's see if the camera works or not let's go into the camera option and uh, let's take some photos here so the camera the camera also works good and uh, also uh, the video recording let's see if the video recording works or not as you can see the video recording also works and you can also see here and uh, let's go and see the gallery the gallery here and each and everything works flawlessly the calculator application as you can see it has an android l experience and uh, also you can access your play store right now i am not signed into my account and uh, each and everything works per per perfectly sorry the notification center and uh, let's go and see the settings option as you can see sim card and uh, sim is enabled so let's so the dual sim doesn't work here 
and uh, I have tried uh, setting up the APN each and everything you can also personalize your uh, status bar on this ROM and when you go into your display uh, you go into your advanced settings so you can also double tap to make it sleep as you can see your device will be in in the sleep mode so this works good and uh, so let's go into the sound and notification and see what's new in, into it nothing new battery light and it just shows you the battery light option as you can see if your battery is low the light will be blinking and uh, let's go into the battery and see if the battery saver mode is is as you can see the battery saver mode is also available and uh, let's go into the privacy privacy card is available and let's go into the build number so let's uh, okay now I have enabled the developers option and uh, yeah, you can see each and everything is available here each and everything works great and if you want to use this as your daily drive go for it as uh, this is the best Android L experience that you can get on your Moto G devices and also you can download your uh, G, uh, Google apps uh, from the Play Store itself uh, so you can access your Play Store and this is how the keyboard looks like so this was my tutorial as how to download Android L on your Moto G single and dual sim variant so do remember single sim variant the sim works but for the dual sim variant the sim, the sim doesn't recognize and it doesn't work uh, for the future updates if an update comes you just have to again go into the recovery mode and flash the rom flash the update so hope you guys like the video find the video helpful. please do comment subscribe hit the like button and if you like the video please do give it a thumbs up and also do follow me on my social networking sites like facebook twitter instagram and google plus till then i'll be seeing you in my next video